Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we'll be doing a challenge question on a packet tracer network representation. Let's get started. Now that you have had an opportunity to explore the network represented in this packet tracer activity, you may have picked up a few skills that you would like to try out. Or maybe you will like the opportunity to explore this network in more detail. Realizing that most of what you see and experience in Packet Tracer is currently beyond your skill level, here are some challenges you may want to attempt. Do not worry if you cannot do them all. You will be a Packet Tracer master user and network designer soon enough. Let's start with the first challenge question. Add an end device to the topology and connect it to one of the LANs with the media connection. So we'll be using home office for this scenario. And adding an end device, so I will choose PC. Close this out. And I will use copper straight through for this media connection. And connect this boat. So we are connected. What else does this device need to send data to other end user? Oh, uh, so it needs an IP address subnet mask and default gateway to communicate with another devices on the network. So can you provide the information? Yes, IP address, subnet mask and default gateway. Is there a way to verify that you're correctly connected to the device? Yes, if you see right here, if the lights are blinking green, that means it is correctly connected to the device. So let's move on to the second question of this challenge. Add a new intermediary device to one of the networks and connect it to one of the LANs or VANs with a media connection. Uh, let's go to the central branch and we will choose switch for this scenario. Uh, actually, we'll use multi-layer switch. And for media connection, we'll be using copper straight through and connecting with the Giga Ethernet 01 to Giga Ethernet 02. So it is connected. What else does the device need to serve as an intermediary to other devices in the network. So it may need some configurations. So it has to be a given from your organization because you have to match the requirement of the network. For the third question, of this challenge is open a new instance of packet tracer, create a new network with at least two LANs connected by a WAN. So we are creating two LANs and one WAN, which is connected to our two LANs. Connect all the devices, investigate original packet tracer activities to see what else you might need to do make your new network functional. Record your thoughts and save your packet tracer file. You may want to revisit your network later after you have mastered a few more skills. So we'll be create, uh, creating a new instance. So no, I don't want to save this for now. And we will be creating two LANs. I will use two PC and one 
lab job and on switch for the media connection i will use copper straight through and for the connections i will use fast ethernet to connect all the devices to the switch so this will be our first LAN. And let's start working on our second LAN. Uh, we'll use two PC, one server. And for the media connection, same, I'll use copper straight. Oh, we need to add a switch. And now we'll be connecting the, these devices with a copper straight through. Fast Ethernet. Fast Ethernet. And again, Fast Ethernet. So now we do have two lands. One second, guys. So we do have two lands right now one is right here and the other one is right here so to connect these two lands we need we need a router so we'll be adding a router to this networks one right here, one right here. And we'll be using media connection. So we'll be using copper straight through to connect router and a switch. And we'll be using giga ethernet connection to connect this boat. Same on the other LAN. Connecting this boat with the giga ethernet. And we need to connect this two routers to make our van successful. So in this router, if you see, there is no ports on it. So we need to add a serial port in order for this to communicate or connect to another router. So we will be adding NIM2T first turn the router off and add the serial port. And since this one is open, I will just cover this up with the cover. So the dust does not go in. Turn on the router, we are set. Same with the second router. Oh, first we need to turn the router off. Add. First we need to turn the router off, then add the module. Same with this phone, I'll cover this up. So I don't want any dust to go in. So the water is on. Now I will use serial DCE to connect these two routers. Serial port on this one, serial 020 on this one. So this is our LAN, this is our LAN and This is our WAN. These two switches or uh, LANs are not communicating with each other because 
we need to configure this network within a, within an IP address, a default a subnet mask, and a default gateway in order this boat to communicate. So, all right, guys, with this, we completed our packet tracer network representation challenge question. And we uh, will be seeing you guys on the other activity. Thanks for watching. Bye.